JOSA Counseling IIT Seat Matrix 2022. JOSA or Joint Seat Allocation Authority established by the Ministry of Education is a single platform used for managing and regulating seat allocation to 114 top Indian institutes, which include 23 IITs, 31 NITs, IIEST Shibpur, 26 triple ITs and 33 government funded technical institutes or GFTIs. JOSA Counseling will admit students into engineering, technology, and architecture or planning programs based on the ranks in JEE Main and JEE Advanced Examinations. This is a post from your favorite education guide, College Suggest. Know your course, know your career. Click on the subscribe button and the bell icon to receive notifications on your favorite courses and careers. In this video, we're going to do a detailed analysis of the JOSA seat matrix specific to IITs previous year trend lines of opening and closing ranks for different courses, an analysis based on data to show which courses will be in demand for 2022. Keep watching this video to know more about the JOSA counseling process. For many students, being accepted into an IIT is the culmination of years of effort and sacrifice. JEE advanced qualifiers can apply for admissions to IITs. Those seeking admissions to NITs, triple ITs, GFTIs, and IIESTs must pass the JEE main exam and then register for JOSA counseling. For details regarding JOSA eligibility criteria, different categories, and a timeline of events during counseling, check out YouTube Shorts in our College Suggest channel or visit collegesuggest.com for further information. First, let's check out the seats allotted to 23 IITs across India. In 2021, a total of 52,453 seats were allocated during JOSA counseling for various degree programs, out of which 16,232 seats were set aside to 23 IITs, which makes up 30.95% of the total seats. Seat distribution is based on the 10 separate categories assigned to candidates, which include open, general economically weaker sections, other backward classes, non-creamy layer, SC, ST, open PWD or person with disability, Gen EWS PWD, OBC NCL PWD, SC PWD, and ST PWD. Students should be aware that there will be two seat pools, one for gender neutral students and one for female students only. Female candidates are eligible for seats in both pools, whereas all non-female candidates will only be eligible for seats distributed under the gender-neutral pool. Now let's get into the details of the seat distribution. In 2021, 16,232 seats for IITs were distributed category-wise as Open Category 6,260 seats, Open PWD 336 seats, SC 2,304 seats, SC PWD 125 seats, ST 1,161 seats, ST PWD 61 seats, Gen EWS 1,526 seats, Gen EWS PWD 75 seats, OBC NCL 4,165 seats, and OBC NCL PWD 219 seats. From this, students can get an idea of the seat matrix and the distribution of seats among different categories in IITs. For 2022 JOSA counseling, this might be the possible breakdown percentage of the seat matrix or they might add a few more seats to some of the courses. Further details about eligibility for JOSA counseling in different types of ranks lists, opening and closing ranks, freeze, slide and float options, and to know about the schedule of events, check out our shorts in College Suggests YouTube channel. For details regarding JOSA counseling, reach out to us and also don't forget to check out our blog at collegesuggest.com. Next, let's take a look at the various courses, their seat distribution, and the most preferred IIT for each course. Based on data from the official JOSA website, the highest number of seats in 2021 was allotted to mechanical engineering courses with a total of 2,131 seats, which makes up 13.13% of the total seats allotted to IIT. The second course was Computer Science with 1,895 seats, and this makes up 11.67% of the total seats. The third was Electrical Engineering with 1,825 seats, which sums up to 11.24% of the seats. The fourth course was Civil Engineering with 1,625 seats, and this makes up 10.01% of the total seats. The fifth course is Chemical Engineering with 1,272 seats, this makes up 7.84% of the seats. And the sixth course is Aerospace Engineering with 225 seats, which makes up 1.39% of the total seats allotted to IITs. 
These six courses sum up to 8,973 seats, which is 55.28% of the 16,232 seats allocated to the 23 IITs. Next, we will look at the trend line of opening and closing ranks for these six courses over a period of the last five years to see which course was trending and in demand for each year. Out of the 23 IITs, based on the opening ranks, we are showing the most preferred IITs for these six courses as it directly indicates that the top rank holder has chosen the particular course at a particular IIT campus because of several reasons that might include the curriculum, practical approaches given in that particular IIT, good placement records, and good infrastructure facilities. Because the opening rank shows that top rank holders select a particular course which is in demand in the job market. And the closing rank helps us to identify within how many ranks a particular course's seats get filled. To put it in simple words, say computer science has a closing rank of 100. Then candidates within 100 ranks chose this course, which obviously shows that there's some competition for this course. And for some other course, if the closing rank was 1000 in the same academic year, then those who have secured ranks up to 1000 can choose that course which shows that the course is not in that much demand compared to computer science for that particular academic year. So for mechanical engineering in 2017, the opening and closing ranks were 3 and 738, and the preferred IIT was IIT Bombay. For computer science, it was 1 and 62 at IIT Bombay. For electrical engineering, it was 1 and 416 at IIT Delhi. For civil engineering, it was 5 and 4582 at IIT Roorkee. For chemical, it was 14 and 1,507 at IIT Bombay. For aerospace, it was 11 and 2,995 at IIT Madras. From this trend line, we can see that in 2017, the course that was most in demand was computer science, as the closing rank was just 62, which means that those who have secured ranks within 62 chose this course, whereas based on the closing ranks, Civil engineering was the least preferred among these six courses because those who have secured ranks up to 4,582 have the preference to choose civil engineering at IIT. Next, let's take a look at the trend line for 2018 for these six courses and see which was in demand. So for mechanical engineering in 2018, the opening and closing ranks were 4 and 3,768 and the most preferred was IIT Kharagpur. For computer science, it was 1 and 173 at IIT Bombay. For electrical engineering, it was 1 and 730 at IIT Bombay. For civil engineering, it was 8 and 4675 at IIT Bombay. For chemical, it was 3 and 2878 at IIT Bombay. For aerospace, it was 4 and 5714 at IIT Kharagpur. So compared to 2017, the preferred IITs for certain courses have changed and still computer science was the most in-demand course among students. Next, let's take a look at the 2019 data. So for mechanical engineering in 2019, the opening and closing ranks were 2 and 3,536, and the most preferred was IIT Bombay. For computer science, it was 1 and 313 at IIT Bombay. For electrical engineering, it was 4 and 1,058 at IIT Bombay. For civil engineering, it was 3 and 5,464 at IIT Bombay. For chemical, it was 42 and 3,952 at IIT Bombay. For aerospace, it was 26 and 4,550 at IIT Bombay. Clearly, IIT Bombay was the most preferred IIT for top rank holders for these six courses. And again, computer science was the most preferred course. Next, let's take a look at the 2020 data. So for mechanical engineering in 2020, the opening and closing ranks were 14 and 3,802. The most preferred was IIT Bombay. For computer science, it was 1 and 338 at IIT Bombay. For electrical engineering, it was 9 and 1,429 at IIT Delhi. For civil engineering, it was 10 and 7,845 at IIT Bombay. For chemical, it was 44 and 5,520 at IIT Delhi. And for aerospace, it was 68 and 5,240 at IIT Bombay. In 2021, IIT Bombay and Delhi were the preferred IITs among students, and again, computer science was the most preferred course. Next, let's check out these six courses in 2021. For mechanical engineering, IIT Delhi was the most sought after. The opening and closing ranks were 12 and 4,607. For computer science, IIT Bombay is the most preferred IIT among students and had an opening and closing rank of 1 and 361. Next is electrical engineering and IIT Kanpur is the most preferred one. 
with opening and closing ranks of 10 and 3409. Next is Civil Engineering and IIT Delhi is the most preferred choice with an opening and closing rank of 32 and 8646. The fifth course is Chemical Engineering and IIT Bombay is the most preferred choice among students with opening and closing ranks of 88 and 4709 respectively. For Aerospace Engineering, IIT Bombay is the most preferred choice among students with an opening and closing rank of 7 and 4419. From this list, based on opening ranks, the most in-demand course according to 2021 would be Number 1. Computer Science Number 2. Aerospace Number 3. Electrical 4. Mechanical 5. Civil and 6. Chemical This is based on the choice made by the top rank holders. For 2022, we're predicting that Computer Science will again be the most highly preferred course and that there will be tough competition to secure this admission. Now, based on the past five years' data, let's check out which is the most preferred IIT for each course. For Mechanical, the most preferred IIT is IIT Bombay. For Computer Science, it is IIT Bombay yet again. For Electrical Engineering, it is both IIT Bombay and IIT Delhi. But in 2021, IIT Kanpur was chosen by top rank holders for this course. For Civil Engineering, it is IIT Bombay. For Chemical Engineering, it is IIT Bombay. And for Aerospace Engineering, it is yet again IIT Bombay. IIT Bombay has been the most preferred IIT for all six courses that we've shown. And let's look at the 2021 seat distribution for these courses so that in 2022, students can be aware of how many seats are available. For Mechanical Engineering, 176 seats were allocated. Computer Science had 171 seats. Electrical Engineering, 101 seats. Civil Engineering, 170 seats. Chemical Engineering, 157 seats, and for Aerospace, 79 seats. So here are our key takeaways. Students should be aware of the entire JOSA counseling process and adhere to the correct dates and deadlines. They should make a list of their preferred courses and colleges. We hope that our video gives you the required information about the most preferred courses and their respective IITs. Computer Science has been the most in-demand course among students for the past five years. We hope that we've given you all the insights you need about JOSA counseling and seat allocation to various courses at different IITs. What is the course that you want to pursue next? Tell us. We will provide all of the information you need to help prove your decision as right. If you agree with our analysis, give us a thumbs up. Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and for more information, visit us at collegesuggest.com.